Hey everyone, Dave here and welcome to Townscaper Overview. Seems like a pretty unique project comparing to all the other titles in the store. It's like if you would combine puzzling places and some building game but then reverse it. <laughs> Sprinkle some little cities and you essentially get this. <laughs> I'm all for artistic stuff though I'm not sure if that's actually game here so we'll see. <laughs> so Townscaper is a procedurally generated building app where simply enough you focus on building something out of nothing using various colors from the palette which creates blocks that shift and change depending on where they're placing with what and gives you a full freedom of creativity. This is very interesting in a way that it does not seem like things get repetitive or one constellation of buildings won't be any different from the other. There's no real point in this title is just to build and enjoy whatever you're creating removing all the traditional quote-unquote obstacles that games serve nowadays. I suppose it's joining the building genre on quest now. With stuff like that however there's always a limit to how much you can do because of the headset capabilities. You're not gonna be able to make like a metro Police or have a full-on simulator of New York. I appreciate it for being relatively unique in the concept. I don't think it's necessarily catering to my taste, so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be finished with this after a couple minutes, but I'm kinda curious how things work here and the various building combinations and connections you can do, like it just seems that every city you'll do, no one else will be able to copy it. Let's go build something! So, we're literally thrown into the world. <laughs> we change colors and then just build. Simple as that, there's no explanation whatsoever, no tutorial, just going with it. I just built some random stuff and then we'll see. Oh wait. <laughs> Randomly in air? This really generates everything I want. What about those colors, I guess? The ground does not change, it's just the buildings. Hello? And they died. I kinda wish I would continuously build. I have to press every single time. Okay, that's my metropolis. It is so interesting how it changes. You can just press every button and then... You're gonna have something, that's for sure. That's actually not a bad idea. Build something around and then everything in the middle. There's no apparent limit to what you do either. At least I don't see it. You can also change the time of the day. Where is the sun though? Okay, here we go. So it does not expand past that. Yeah, okay. That's a lot anyways, no? I feel like this is gonna be a very fast overview because it just depends on what you think of. There's not much to talk about either, it's just you build and that's what the focus is on. Thing is just transforming. So basically the grid is the limit but not the actual things you can build. Well, I guess the height, yes. That's still a lot for a quest application. I should change colors every now and then. <laughs> Okay, 
That's my creative chaos. <laughs> Maybe let me build something more cohesive. We start by the street. We're at water though, okay. <laughs> Let's pretend this is a road. Then we have a parking. Okay, well, I scrapped the idea already. <laughs> Apparently when you close things there's gonna be garden. Yeah, so it's like you discover hidden mechanics as well. Oh wow. <laughs> really there are a lot of combinations. You can just keep going and that's gonna be the gameplay, like, there's so many possibilities. <laughs> I honestly can just spend a lot of time here if I will be actually creative. But regardless for the price, content, potential, like, it's perfect. <laughs> What I can say more about, I mean, I wish there would be some music or just more customization in the technical aspect, but you get what you want, essentially. Like, I don't see anything wrong with it. It's just very innovative. Really, like, I've not seen anything like this, and people who like this stuff will definitely enjoy it. Birdies.